without heat. Do me a favor, please. Get out of here. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Miss Lauren Lee 11 and today guys I'm going to be sharing how to get your hair smooth and sleeky again once it's been straightened without using heat. Yes, without heat. Do me a favor please, get out of here. Get out of here man! One product that I've used, it's from the line that I use, so you may think that it may have something to do with hair grease. It doesn't, it doesn't. I'm I'm confused! But before we get onto that, if you like my channel and the content that I put out, but you're not yet subscribed, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, guys. Hit the notification bell, give me a thumbs up, leave your comments down below. Anyway, let's jump into the video. Let's just talk about the disrespect that my hair is showing me. If you can see this, look at my edges. Look at my edges. The other day my hair looked like it was relaxed. Now my hair has reverted and it looks like I'm transitioning my hair. So this is what happened when I done a bit of a workout. So as you can see guys, I have no chemicals in my hair. My hair has just been straightened using hair grease if you saw my last video. I've had my hair straightened since Monday. Now it's Sunday, so let's just say for a whole week. My hair is due for a wash just because my scalp is itching like crazy. But I just wanted to show you this guys quickly before I washed out my hair because I don't know if I'm gonna straighten it straight away again. I'm just gonna try and help you guys. And you're thinking, oh my gosh, and it's like right at my edges and I need to put heat on it again. No, no heat, no you don't. How to wait. So basically I'm gonna incorporate into this video what you can do at night as well, just as a general precaution. But if this does happen and your hair starts to revert back to curly, what you can do to make it straight and silky again. Yes, yes, please just give it to me. So I've got this particular product that I've discovered and I'm going to show it to you right now. Dax for naturals. Yes, guys, Dax make Dax products for naturals. So this is where I was saying that it's kind of similar, but it's not because it's from the same brand, but it's not a hair grease. Although the end result kind of ends up like a hair grease with a hold. Let me get onto it, guys. So it says Dax Naturals and it says Styling Pomade. It contains broccoli seed oil and passion fruit oil. And it says put a fingernail size amount of styling cream. Now, usually as a natural, you don't tend to listen to the instructions. You just take a dollop. With this, you need to take fingernail size amount because this product goes a long way. Right, so let me just show you guys. So this is what it looks like if you can see that and this is the texture. It's quite creamy, really thick, really thick guys. Now what I do love about this product is my hair is a mixture between 3C down to 4A. My daughter's hair is predominantly 4B with bits of 4C in there, okay? Now being that her hair is coarser than mine, I find that butters, creams and smoothies do not do it for her hair. However, this lays her hair immaculately. So basically what I'm gonna show you how to lay these edges down. And with this, I'm not gonna take a fingernail size amount. I'm gonna take this much, apply it to the parts of my hair that are curly. So as you can see guys, this product goes on white. Thanks Captain Obvious. And you may think that you have to rub it in. But no, 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 no. Leave it. Because as this product sits on your hair, it starts to turn, like I said, a bit like a hair grease and it's completely transparent. So what I'm gonna do now, lay my edges, these little parts, with the remainder of my hair. And what I mean by that is, let me show you guys. What I want to do is put the thicker part of my hair over my edges, like so. And as you can see already, guys, that is laying my hair. But you don't want to disrupt the hair product just yet because it's not dried. It's not wet, but it's not set, let's say. So this is what I've got so far. As you can see, it has literally pulled my hair back. Lovely. So let's just do the other side. Okay. And I'll do the exact same thing. So this very part of my hair is the part that likes to revert the most very quickly. And it may seem like a lot that I'm putting on, but as you can see, guys, this side has now gone transparent okay so as I'm saying if you've woken up you've wrapped your hair in everything but it's still reverted this is what you can quickly do in the morning if you want to wear your hair out as well so even though my hair sleek down I'm going to then take it back out don't worry guys don't worry everything will fall into place don't worry okay so I'm gonna do what I did on that side I'm gonna take the thicker part of my hair and comb it over my edges so this thicker part as I said is now laying my edges. What is on your face? Um, beauty. 
You just have to make sure everything is nice and smooth, how you would lay your edges. And if you're getting a bit of resistance from those edges, then as I said, you can put on a headscarf. I know everybody's not got a similar hair type like mine, as I've obviously explained, I'm very aware of that. Do not expect to get the exact same results as me. So that's what we've got so far, okay? As you can see, nice and sleek. I love these results. I'll go out like this. Okay, so now for the ends. My ends aren't too bad because I've been wrapping them at night, but not wrapping them how you think. I haven't been wrapping my hair entirely around. Let me just show you. I haven't necessarily used this on the ends. I'm going to for video purposes. And as you can see on my hands, guys, I don't know if you can see it, it's got a slight shine to it, so that's how your hair will start to dry. I'm gonna rub it between my hands and literally apply to the ends. All right, so you don't want too much because you don't want your hair to become too greasy. So what you're gonna do now, guys, you're gonna keep your hair as taut as possible so the hair sets in this straight position. Now, you're going to want to take a hairband or a hair tie or whatever you want to call it. And what you're going to do, this is the secret to getting a little wave to your hair and keeping the ends moisturised. Watch. So you're going to twist your hair, if you can, into a big chiny bump. Or bantu knot. So you twist to the very end and then wrap those ends around. Okay. And there you leave it. You get on with what you need to do for about 10 to 15 minutes. And then when the products dry, I'll come back and show you the magic of how your hair can be silky smooth in a small amount of time. So guys, I am back. Are you ready for the reveal? My hair dry for about an hour, um, longer than anticipated because I was doing something. But I'm going to show you the results now. So, and by the way guys, just a quick tip. This is how I sleep with my hair. I usually put it in two though because it's not comfortable to sleep with the bun at the back like that. But basically this is how I preserve my hair whilst it's straight. So, are you ready for the big reveal? Okay. <laughs> So, you can see my hair looks super nice, moisturized, wavy, lovely. Right now for the edges, guys. So you remember how my edges were curly in the beginning, okay? If you can see this, look at my edges. Look at my edges. Okay. So let me just show you here. Look at that. Oh. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Do my edges not look relaxed? Isn't that crazy? There you go. So that is how I lay my edges and re-straighten my hair, basically. I will put all the details in the description box of the product, the Dax Naturals product. But there you have it, my guys. I wouldn't actually say to do this too many times, guys, because then obviously your hair will start to get greasy. But why am I so close to you in the camera? I don't know. <laughs> But yes, guys, this is a little quick trick just to, you know, finish the hairstyle off if you're going to wash it the next couple of days or the next day or so. But yes, that is it, guys. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share this video and follow me on Instagram. All right, guys, thank you so much for your support. Take care. Bye bye. We want happy hair. My hair's happy now. <laughs> I'm going to be giving you 10 reasons as to why I love hair grease and why you should too. Try that, man. But other than that, it's amazing for keeping your hair amazing. Obviously. Lanolin, mineral oil, petroleum. I should put it on a t-shirt. But it seals in the seal. Oh, I'm thirsty. <laughs> 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 anyway, <laughs> thank you for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye.